uh, every single time, every single time he um, decided to make, uh, what do you call them, those, uh, those floating things on the, the Zerg team, right? Every time he used to make one of those, he used to go and hide it in, like, the furthest fucking corners, like, the, the tiniest, like, little edges of the screen. Like, if I was to, like, put something somewhere, it would be, like, he'd have it up here somewhere, right? Um, that's what he would do. So I would always have to go out of my way to try to find, like, whether or not you can still do that on these maps, I don't know. But he, I would have to go out of my way to try to find wherever it is. Can I not just attack it? Uh, attack to destroy it. How do I just attack it? Alright, I can't attack it with you for some reason. Off you go. Somebody building something? Can I get up there? Somebody's... Oh, that's that. I was going to say, I'm like, I'm hearing something getting built. I'll tell you what, let me go build over here because I can just get this. And I can't do anything with this, so I might as well. Also, it's got like a lot of like theatrical space movie music vibes going at the moment. Not bad, but I just feel like I can't place the movie. You know? Very dramatic. Alright, well, I don't know quite where you guys are going, but you've got my people in it. I... Ooh, I'm still alive up here. Alright. Let's kill a couple of these things. The little ground units will keep my person safe. Oh yeah, there's a couple more of them. You guys coming down here? Alright. Let's get all the way in here. And I might be able to actually get them killed. I'll tell you what, since that's the way it's kind of going, we've got two enemies down. Let's get you up here. So I think yellow just went down. So yellow and one of the colors. Let's go for red. Let's go for red. All right? This will be done in a minute. And yeah, all right. I don't know where you guys are going. Can you not get to them? You should be able to get to them. I reckon, I think it was red and whatever the other colour was. I'm not sure what the other colour was. So, yeah. Oh, I know. Fucking hell, it's a staple. Are in battle. <laughs> they are, but is there any other... There's... My people are all green. I wish my people would show up as my colour. I know it's supposed to be like you have your constant color the kind of thing is you're green but yeah it gets confusing when I'm not green and I'm looking for my people on the map and I haven't played this for a while so my brain doesn't automatic to that's me fucking hell they're all absolutely trying to repair it at the same time that should be it oh man fucking hell way to go oof that was something yeah, we took off. We took off so hard there. It was great. Oh, the ad starts a minute. Let's skip. Let's skip this ad. Um. Well, I can snooze it apparently. That's fine. Um. Yeah. All right. Well, let's see. What's the largest size one? You can have eight. I think Morris's. What? Uh, lava? A lot of the big ones are lava. I, um, I don't get much out of the lava maps. I don't know why. I do like the sandy beachy ones, but I die on them because I get distracted by all the little things. That is... That's the most absolute just square on a map I've seen. Go, go through the next picture. It's terrible. That's like slums. Uh, my eyes? Boneyard. I feel like I I don't always see all the maps I used to play on. And I do wonder how many are upgraded. That looks like it's huge. Also, there's like these little like light encampment things. Kind of look pretty. Alright, what do we got? I'm not doing a one side versus other side again. Not anytime soon. Let's get you two together. Oh, not quite. Come on, you can do it. 
Go for it, mate. Oh, don't do this shit. It, it did this to me one other time. And I couldn't get them to connect into the other area. It was frustrating because all it does is swaps them over. Um, it allows extra, let's see, miscellaneous, other, master infinite, custom teams. Mm, what about free for all? Free for all, and can I have. Man, I must have always just played on free for all. <laughs> That's exactly what it immediately is. All right, let's go with custom teams. Uh, not like that. Oh, I just set it back to what it was. Interesting. Um, okay, come with me, you. I want you. Uh, I just want this to like pair up. I don't care if I have to separate them all. I'll have to go down to like one less ally if that's the case. The us two against everyone. I have a better color than that. Let's make you pink again. Make you like any other color, like brown. Um, I would actually prefer instead of orange, you'd be like light green. Very close to yellow, but it's not quite. Let's start that game. I'll get a stretch on. Oh man. I need that stretch. It was like one of those stretches where like, I don't know if I received or had energy taken from me in that moment. I don't know if anybody else has like stretches like that where like, you just kind of like everything feels great, but like you're tired straight after it. I had that kind of stretch. It's a good stretch. Pop you over there. I'm in. I've heard of people say like, you know, like first thing in the morning when you wake up and you get out of bed and you stretch and stuff. And I've always been like, I never think to get up and stretch, but if you actually do when you wake up, it's actually really a nice feeling. It just like everything kind of like gets a little bit of motion and it's also about the fastest way to get a leg cramp, in my opinion, but I mean, it could just be how I'm stretching. Ran into an enemy base. <laughs> I always, I'm, I think because like, I used to do a lot of sports and stuff. And then when I did my weightlifting and stuff, I did a lot of leg weights. I think I'm like predisposed to getting like excessively bad leg cramping. Like really, really bad. Like basically like, you know, where it feels like basically your legs just been like hacked into or something because like I think some people call it like a charley horse we also just call it like just a leg cramp but it's like that we get like that really like bad like <laughs> hell on the ground kind of like roll around kind of cramp in your leg yeah I always yeah. used to get those I heard that like you're supposed to like drink more water if you get a lot of leg cramps and stuff which I did always kind of did but I feel like maybe never enough although I have also heard that apparently you can get like cramps from drinking too much water as well be interested to know if anybody has like a like a thought on that let me make a couple of you guys I don't really want zealots but I am right next to an enemy so I'd rather be safe I think I've got another one on my other side I think I've got one here too by the look of it. I've got one here. Yeah. Alright, yeah, we're basically kind of fucked, if that's the case. Look, I'm aware of that, but let's get those two working. Let's get one of these working. What the? I can thank you for the gift sub. Shadow's, like, currently lurking, watching anime. Um, so thank you for the gift sub, and I can't believe you're managing to catch one of my streams. Viking 2. Again, thank you. No, you'd ha you don't have to do that, but I know that, like, you'll do it anyway. Um, how you been? That's not an answer. <laughs> thank you. Oh, man, Mirthless. Mirthless Viking Shadow. If you can hear me, you guys all got gift subs. And remember to say thank you. Fucking hell. It has been so long, Chaos Senpai. How you doing? Um... How did your fucking crowns go, the dentist, the here. other day? Um, I, I, like, I feel like the last saw you in Mirthless stream a while ago when you were getting that done. 
and then like the time before that was when you just got your teeth prepared in advance for it. It's been fucking ages. Uh, I'm waiting for another dental appointment. <laughs> what at the moment? It's like this is this is the reality of Triantha is like he goes to the dentist and then he just like um creates chaos. That that's what happens. That's it's all all that's like reality. That's it, man. This is the King of Chaos Senpai thinks so. Oh wait, well, fuck off, mate. Not this guy's like attacking me from the back. Yeah, also happy Valentine's Day, Trantha. I'm doing kind of like a Valentine's Day uh, question Q&A thing. So like if you have any like random questions that have never really fitted into like a general train of conversation or related to games and stuff like that, you're welcome to ask. Um, I had some interesting ones tonight. I also had some ones where like, oh shit, they destroyed me. Um, I've also had some like really challenging questions too in there as well. I'm going to die straight off the bat. I'm between two enemies, my enemies between an enemy. I I can't defend this. Like even if I wanted to. <laughs> I just don't have the Vespian gas for it. Look, we'll pump out a couple of these guys if I can even get one out. Oh man. Yeah, I'm so going to die. Um fucking hell. Yeah, I was just like in the middle of having a stretch and it was like making me sleepy and stuff. And um, then you came in and like did that. I really appreciate it though. Thank you for the gift subs. Um you know. I I got my air conditioner fixed, Trantha. I don't know if you like managed to hear a lot of the stuff that's happened over January, because I know like your work times and stuff kinda changed. And it's made it like really difficult. Uh, if I can just get this out. Yeah, alright, we've got a couple more. Don't run up to the back, dude. Trust me. That was a waste. This guy was like, I'm gonna like bum rush the guy at the back instead of attacking the guy at the front. I'm just gonna die. Uh, I'm. Oh, are you my allies? You're my allies. Oh, man. So if you're waiting for the dentist today, is it like a follow-up or have you got like more crowns to get done or what's going on? Um, curious to sort of know what's happening. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna straight up die. I, I don't think I can recover from this. Our ally is doing good though. I think they're killing them and I just can't kill these guys. I can't get enough out. I also don't have enough Vespian gas. Tell you what, let's dump it dump it in there and just everybody get on that. I don't care, you guys can queue. A couple of you can go stand over there. Alright, let's see if I can get some Vespian gas out, for the love of God. Yeah, I'm, I'm aware. Let's, let's spring that one up. Come on. Just make one stalker dude. I don't even know what that guy is. What are you? Are you the... What is this thing? Adept? It was temp crown the last time. Oh yeah, the permanent. Wow, I died. Permanent came in from the lab, so uh, now I get that installed. Nice. If they had a temporary one put on, um, is there much work in like changing that over? Because I know that, like, when you had it like cleared out, it, you said that it was like really fragile and you had to like protect it kind of thing for like a week, be careful with it and stuff. And then obviously like you've had the temporary one. So is there going to be much involved? Will they, um, do they have to like put you out or like, uh, well obviously it probably give you some kind of level of painkillers and stuff for it. Um, well, depends, I guess. From what I understand with the crown stuff, like that just, pop off the temporary one and put the um blue down the other one right but the uh the root of the tooth would be pretty sensitive i'd imagine i i don't know too much about it all i do know is i did change over i changed my toothpaste you know how um i kept saying that my toothpaste every time i used it my entire mouth peeled so we changed my toothpaste and now it feels like my mouth is covered in blisters around the edges of my gums, around like my teeth and stuff. So it's somehow worse, <laughs> so much worse. Um, 
But yeah, there's, I don't know, when I finish that particular uh, pack of toothpaste or whatever, I'll, I'll try a different one again. But it just feels like the inside, like where the tooth touches the gum on the inside of my mouth, it just feels like bruised and like, uh, kind of like, you know, when you get like a, a cut or uh, no, a blister, a blister, but there's no top. And it has that like overexposed painfulness. It feels like that. That's what it feels like. So it's it's really fucking uncomfortable at the moment. Cause like anytime my tongue touches it, it's just like, eh. <laughs> so thanks for your sub, Tim, man. Thank you so much. This should just be trimming it to fit it. Nice. Um, yeah, I feel like um, I was saying this, like I think literally just yesterday, it was like getting a little bit like lonely in here. Cause like I was pretty much like everybody's kind of been a bit busy with stuff or like schedules and things have changed and stuff and it's kind of just honestly missing everyone and um yeah it's kind of nice to sort of seeing a lot of like a lot of faces that i haven't seen for a little while it's it's really nice um am i allergic to fluoride i don't think so i used to take fluoride tablets when i was a child um just to kind of like benefit us and stuff when we're growing up because like my, my dad's teeth are like horrendous um but i i know for a fact that i have a very sensitive uh i guess pretty much like my skin in general is sensitive i should say um because like even if i use like uh adhesive dressings and stuff like that on like external wounds and stuff right um i tend to have the skin underneath the uh, sensitive patch blister or um was it it like welts up it's um kind of kind of like hives but not kind of thing but only underneath the spots in contact with adhesives and stuff um but then again like with toothpaste I, I always stuck with we had Colgate for pretty much most of my life um and then when my teeth went to sensitive, I changed from sensitive. Well, I changed from Colgate toothpaste to a sensitive brand of toothpaste. There's another one that's in between that. That's a regular one that um, also completely like uh, skins my mouth every time I use it. Um, it's just generally unpleasant. Like I kind of don't want to go back to the, the one that I was using because it's not strong enough to work for the like hot cold sensitivity of my teeth but at the same time like the alternative is that I have like uh either like lacerations or like fucking healing it's one pain or the other and honestly the pain of like every time I take a drink of water or inhale in winter being basically like somebody's like shanked my mouth versus that um I do have sensodyne as well um use it I find it's like liniment rub though. I I've, I found that like I I couldn't keep using it because it just felt like I was brushing my mouth with liniment rub. There was another one in between it. There was Sensodyne. There's Oral B is the worst one I've got. Um, and there's a third one, and I don't remember what the third one is, but the third one doesn't work. Um, so Sensodyne works, but tastes like I'm like scrubbing my mouth with liniment rub. Earl B skins everything and whatever the third one is just doesn't actually work. Uh, it came from the middle of fight scenes. Thank you, but really gotta go back. It's very intense. No worries, Shadow. I know you're watching the um the anime. Um also resting on Viking as well. I think Viking may have like fully dozed off at this point, which is fine. Alright, I did like a little bit better, but I'm I'm right next to like an enemy. So I'm not expecting to like survive this, although there is additional places I can build back there, maybe. Maybe I can sneak one back here. But if I don't use Sensodyne, I'll use a homemade one for my wife. That's pretty cool that she can make like a homemade one for that. I tend to find like I've tried I gave most brands a straight up go when I had to change over to sensitive toothpaste. A lot of sensitive toothpastes here are really expensive. 
Um, so I can only like try one at a time. Did you just resurrect my guy on your team? Bastard. Yeah, anyway. Um, yeah, so I can only like use one at a time. Right, but um, so far I've gone around all of the Sensodyne ones. I tried a couple of other brand ones. I tried a really cheap one. I had high hopes for that, but it didn't work. And it was a couple of other ones. Yeah, you take on that little thing, you bastard. Oh man. Also, I'm up in the corner because like every time I play StarCraft, I end up raging out. So I kind of figured if I sit up here um, and I start raging out, it's not as bad. Are you still making things? You are. Cool. Go help him. Actually, you know what would be smarter than that is go kill the pylon. It stops him from having unit production. Look, you attack that one and you attack that. There we go. Teamwork. Oh man. I look forward to the day that I find a two face that doesn't fuck with my mouth. That actually like works comfortably. No, no, no. Don't go into the trap of getting in the cluster. Yeah, I, I'd look forward to that. Um, I also like try to brush like pretty gently. But yeah, there's not much I can do. I also do not believe that it helps that I also enjoy eating lemons and like every so often throughout the year I just go through a stage where I like only want to eat lemons. So I believe that that's a lot of my problem. I believe that that's actually how I got to sensitive teeth problem. It's just eating lemons. Because like, I'm, I'm talking about like eating them as if they're an orange. Like that kind of way. Um, which is really funny because I remember when I was talking to my dentist originally and I said that I liked eating lemons and stuff. And the first thing that they thought that I meant is you know how a lot of people just like add a little bit of lemon to like a glass of water and stuff? So that was the assumption. I'm like, oh no, no, I don't. I'm not drinking weak shit, I'm drinking like the whole fucking, I'm eating the whole lemon. Um, they just like looked at me and they're like, well that's not good for your teeth. And I'm like, I'm aware of this, but I like the food. I also, honestly, I don't care if it's like, you know, the, the fake lemon juice that you can get in like a bottle. I don't really mind that. Uh, I'm sure it's probably actually lemon juice, but it's got some kind of preservative of some sort in it. Alright, well this is definitely going to be my place now. Since we got them cleared out. I know they got an ally. This might be one of the few times where I can actually build extra. I don't know what you're doing up here. But sure. Okay, look. You go down there. You start on that. I'll send a couple of extras down. That, uh, actually... Yeah, I know. What are you fighting? Ugh. You guys are exhausting. I don't have energy for that. Like, I, I'm i going to make stalkers. Fuck it. Oh, man. Ugh. Yeah, what else have you been up to, Triantha? Have you still been, like, starting later with work? Um, I feel like I haven't got to, like, there's probably, like, a million questions I've got for you and I haven't got a chance to ask. Also, yeah, if you have any random questions for me, go for it. Um, yeah, I'm going to take, oh, are you not going to build? Hold on. We have discovered sure had enough. Base. All right. All right. Well, off you go. Oh yeah. It's all right. Got enough spare. I've even got one back here as well. I don't really want to have like extra extra bases everywhere because it's just going to cost me extra money. These little creatures, this um, uh, what are they? The fucking probes are also going to cost me a fair bit. But what I want. There's a few three. Okay, come and do me a solid. I and I want... Alright, we are going to need to have some extra of these first. Have that. 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 I know that the top keys for this are. Okay. Alright, let's make a few of these bosses. Alright. Yeah, schedule at this point is where you're getting off stream. Yeah, I know I sometimes like see you in um, Mathless stream and uh, it is nice because like at least then I get to like say hello and stuff but I also know that like you've often said it's quite cold at the moment and uh, you don't get like a, as much of a chance to talk so 
yeah, it's it's been a bit. I feel like it's been a bit since I've got to like actually really catch up, you know. Um, I think if there was anything else that's happened, I feel like there's like been little things that have happened that uh, I haven't like got to like tell you about or this and that. My rumor colony finally reached a point where um I hit a limit for it though yesterday. That was interesting. Um, but yeah, apart from that, I'm going to build a few of these in a moment. I am the voice. So hopefully a few months I'll be back to, uh, I'll be back. I'm old school, so I'll be around a lot more. Uh, I'm school. Are you doing, um, are you doing a course? I am here in the shadows. Are you saying you're old school or are you saying you're, I don't know, I'll wait. <laughs> I'll wait for you to clarify that one. But yeah, it's nice when you're in a channel with your viewers. I feel like it gives you an opportunity to chat without distractions. Oh yeah, you're back in school. All right. Yeah, no, that'd be nice. it will be nice to have you back around. Yeah, I also agree with that, Mudless. Like, it's interesting. Um, like, I always say, like, you know, put your lives first. Everybody has their life that's... I think I just made a pylon. Everybody has stuff going on in their lives, and you guys will come and go, and I understand that. Um, I never expect anybody to be here every stream, all stream. That's just ridiculous. But um, at the same time, like, when you guys are gone and, you know, you miss kind of chatting to your regular faces and stuff, um, it feels different, you know. It kind of hits differently. Um, and it kind of has felt like that for, like, a little while lately. Has kind of been like I've just been kind of missing everybody. And everybody's been kind of like coming in for like a little bit. At, whenever you guys have had a chance, you've made it in, and that's wonderful. But I, I genuinely miss like the conversations. Um, I, I find it interesting though, because like as much as I'm an introvert, I guess like there's still like a social connection kind of thing that's like there, that like I've like grown to have with you guys, which is awesome. Like obviously like. As I've said before, I, I don't like the concept of just streaming to like, uh, I don't know, an empty, empty crowd, I guess, if that makes sense, like to nobody. Um, but yeah, at the same time, it's just, I don't know. It's like, actually, I found a, a great fucking example is, you know, when you go to school and your best mate's sick and you know they'll be back like next week and everything and you just can't hang out just at the moment but you know they're fine right and it's it's great it's just that like you miss them for those couple of days and things just don't feel right kind of thing that's that's what it's like let's go fuck them up yeah they're already accepting defeat if they're there and we should be going this way actually no i'll help them with purple fuck it let's do it I don't know if anybody else already resigned here. Yeah, I don't think so. Mm, maybe we go over here. I want to make a few more, a few more flying guys. I don't know. I I don't know. I, I do think about it sometimes. I'm like uh, offline and I'm working on something, and I'm like, it feels like he's missing. You know, so I'm gonna see if they're ready for me, so I'll be looking. No worries. Thank you for stopping by. It's been great getting a chance to say hello again. Um, and hey, if you're not, if they're not ready to take you in yet, I'm ready to, ready to have you around. So, it's, it's fine either way. Oh man, I'll tell you what. I um, I I know sometimes when I'm like. You know when you're bad at conversation? <laughs> it's just naturally bad at conversation. I say some things sometimes and I'm like, man, that was terrible. <laughs> that last sentence, that was terrible. <laughs> For real. I'm like, I could have said that better. But <laughs> I can, I don't know. English. I keep saying this English is challenging around. I am a native English speaker. Let me clarify that. I speak English naturally, but fucking hell doesn't mean I'm good at, like, figuring out what I want to say. Oh, man. Oh. oh, that reminds me, too. Um, I need to... Next time I see Eternal Dipsy, I've got to say thank you for the Prime sub, too. Um, I didn't realize that they gave me a Prime sub yesterday. 
I, I know that they were, they were talking about they had one spare, but I didn't realize that they used it on me. Some of my notifications have not been working, so I just haven't known. And I fucking hate when the sub ones don't work because obviously you guys have taken the time to, like, you know, sub to me and stuff and they don't work. Look at this fucking ceiling that I hit, though. Eesh. Look at that. That's that's almost the right fucking angle. At one point, I just succeeded. Uh, and the enemies kind of killed each other off real, real early, though. Uh, 